welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the Sun moon and rising um, uh, Capricorns for the month of September 2017 and this month of September I have is the energy vibration of um, the wheel of fortune so that is the general energies for the month of September I want to say thank you so much to each and every person out there that has uh, been supporting my channel and helping me and working we're all working together on a journey I want to say thank you for all the message that was left behind all the support all the likes all the shares all the thumbs up with these energy vibration reading we need to start thinking positive and to be more aware because we are the energy vibration that keeps the energy on this planet going okay so this is wonderful um, it is going to be the month of September is going to be a very wonderful positive positive situation a, um, a positive energy of um, good things coming in in our life whatever the energy and the situation is in September September is going to be a month of change in the guards a lot of people who have changed career is going to see that wonderful new things exchange of uh, help exchange of diff and a syn a synchronicity is going to happen in your life whatever is happening you need to understand that the first week is the energy vibration of judgment second week we're going to have the energy vibration of uh, the earth energy which is the world and the world comes up twice so there's going to be a extremely a lot of success for you Capricorns in the month of September the month of September is going to be an extremely successful month for you Capricorns okay extreme success is going to come in for you Capricorns in the month of September whatever is happening for you guys in the month of September is for you Capricorns uh, expect um, success coming in um, in the month expect a huge success coming in okay so I always write down the name of it because we have um, um, help we have uh, serendipity we have uh, um, exchange of gifts okay exchange of gifts is working with people in organization and groups the number three is going to be the energy vibration whatever the situation is the energy of number three is coming up with the energy of number three coming up it's going to be a positive one your focus in this month of September is going to be the energy of the world this is a positive positive situation and again I am aware that some people wants to know what is the deck that I'm using and it's the dream way Tarak of the the dream way Tarak so a lot of situations are going to be happening a lot of changing of the guard is going to be happening um, whatever the situation is you're going to see positive endeavors coming out in your life okay so as we look forward let's see what other messages are here for the Capricorns in the first week and the Capricorns in the second week of August Capricorns in the third week of August Capricorns in the fourth week of August the Prince of Cups okay the Prince of Cups okay whatever is happening um, out there to you Capricorns the number three is plain such a huge significance three and nine okay let's look at this we have the world once the world twice okay and the world energy is the second week which is the energy of the world and it's three times so whatever that is that is huge success coming up because the energy of the world energy is all way success so a lot of you Capricorns are going to be extremely and when I said extremely successful oh my gosh okay okay are you going to be extremely extremely successful in the um, in, 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 in the month of September um, it's going to be a successful time for you Capricorns in the month of September because the world is your energy vibration and the world comes up like um, three time um, 
some projects or, or some project or situations are now completed okay so there's going to be a completion of some project or situation that is happening in your life it's going to indicate successful uh the indication of a successful time ending and uh, endings of your journey okay um, the elements of having come together and bringing forth harmony and a sense of fulfillment it's going to have an ending of one stage of your life and the start of another and this is so wonderful so there is going to be some capricorns are going to have huge accomplishment in september some are going to have happiness some are going to be sharing joy with others some are going to have a completion of a project or a situation some are going to have fulfillments of your heart desire so September is going to be a very wonderful positive positive situation that will be happening in September okay let's look at the month of September for you Capricorns there is actually four weeks in the month of September remember the number three the number nine is here um, number three and number nine so we have number three number 33 number nine number 21 number 21 and um, that's it so we have number three number nine um, number 21 number three number nine and number 21 okay all right damas and Aries. let's look at what is happening in your life in this month okay in the first week we have the energy vibration as coming to the edge in the first week of September so whatever is happening you're feeling as if you're coming to the edge um, and that means it's as if you think oh my god I'm I'm, I'm, I'm really this is so much this is so overwhelming um, you're really coming yeah to whatever situation but if we start looking um, from this way for the men in the first week this is going to have a huge effect on you um, Capricorn men in the first week whatever the situation is uh, you are having a conflict with other people so for you Capricorn men whatever is happening there is a huge conflict that is happening people are trying to um, murder you they're, they're speaking bad about you you know this is a <laughs> You know, this is something, you know, the, whoever the artist of this card is, as must have gone through whatever that child is going through in this reading. And this is why he plays it out in his drawing. And this is situation that happens to people in organization and situation. And you see here that people are, bla are beating up on you and you know calling you names and really look at this this is a bad situation for some men out there and it could be women also so if you are in a training and if you're in any form of a schooling a situation like this is going to affect you in the first week of September okay whatever is happening if you're in training with other people and that sort of a thing people are going to be speaking bad about you trying to call you names trying to slap you on your hands trying to do these negative things to you and you're going to feel as if you're coming to the edge you're going to feel as if you're coming to the edge you know people are very very especially when you are doing well in something they will have so many bad things and hateful things people are very hateful so you have to be aware of this people are extremely hateful be aware of this and you're going to feel as if you're coming to the edge in the first week of September but you need to hold on hold on because at the end of the day things are going to be happening for you wow this is nasty this is nasty the number nine energy is there so you're being protected the five of of ones is always a conflicts with other people as we look at the second week the second week is the energy of the heart and energy of the heart care the energy of the world you also have the energy vibration of whatever is coming in and I need to read it back ways for you guys we have the energy of the world, which is the ending of a cycle and the beginning of something very, very beautiful. Whatever that has happened, the cycle is ended in the second week and the world, the universe, 
um, success is coming at you and this is going to be wonderful success there is a huge celebration you are having a celebration the energy of the world is here twice in this week twice in the second week so the second week of September is going to be a positive positive week for you Capricorns out there so the world is there and you're having a huge celebration because it's the end of something it's the end of a journey it's the end of a victory you are being celebrating something and and that is uh, you know and this is why that you were getting so much hate in the beginning of the month in the first week because you had conflicts with other people you were getting so much hate so much people were speaking about you so much people were speaking behind you they were hating on you but they hating on you at the end of the day and the second week you are come to the end of something and you're celebrating and you're moving on and you are going to get a huge push huge help coming into you in the second week because you know if you're in a situation that you have these people hated on you the universe is going to send someone and whenever the universe gives you a huge push up the ladder you are going to be slipping up the ladder and staying up there okay so whoever that has been eating you and all the people that is going to be eating you in the first week of September you understand try and understand and connect back and understand that the world is about to open up for you in the second week and you can see this as a celebration and help is coming in in the second week my 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 there there are people in this world their heart is sick whatever it is Dom is in here and just leave them let they hate on you but um wow third week the two last week the three last week of september is going to be so positive okay let's read this one back way in the third week you have a situation with the queen of swords this is a nasty person this is this is someone who you need to keep clear of whoever this queen of sword is she's nasty oh she wants to gut you please be aware of this person this energy has been coming up for a lot of people this is a nasty person this is someone who is not really honest this can be an Aquarius a Libra or a Gemini whoever this person is I'm getting the energy vibration of a Libra be clear to this person because this person wants to gut you she wants to get at you you know be clear of who this person is okay it can be someone who is very close to you a friend that you have that is very close to you who is a Libra okay be clear of this person whatever is happening is that you either are a friends with this person because it's the connection of the number three you're working in groups so this person could be your friend but you need to stay clear of this person this person is not a very nice person she wants to gut you you know she's very jealous there is a streak of jealousy that is coming out of this person for you be aware of this but know that you are protected in whatever this situation is it is the energy vibration of an Aquarius so some people you will have this a situation with an Aquarius some people you will have this situation with a Gemini some people most of the majority of you is going to have it with a Libra okay whatever is happening the exchange of gifts is coming in the third week so this is wonderful whenever this energy vibration of exchange of gifts is coming in is that whatever you gave out whatever positive energies and positive things you have given out it's going to be returned to you whatever positive situation that you have done for other people it's going to be returned to you and this is going to be extremely positive okay so this is wonderful whoever this person is it's uh, I'm getting an energy vibration from a liberal be aware of her because it's not really one of the nicest person okay in the fourth and last week we have the energy vibration of the Prince of Cups the Prince of Cups is the energy vibration of someone between the ages of 80 and 35 this week is going to affect these Prince of Cups and it's going to help you um, whoever this Prince of Cups is it can be coming in as your boss your supervisor your kids or someone as a relationship a partnership but it's more of a situation yeah because it could be your father or it could be um, it could be your father because I'm seeing the situation but whatsoever that is happening you have the energy of the Emperor here the energy of the Emperor here so whoever this um, 
prince of uh, cups is he has a situation in an organization and he says he's looking at you and he's thinking oh my god whoever this person is they are going to be helping you is as if synchronistic event is going to happen between you and the Prince of cups and the energy vibration of the emperor what happened with the energy vibration of the emperor you're going to see positive situations coming in your life especially for the people who are working or the, uh, the people who have their business if your father is the energy vibration of an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius or your partner is the energy vibration of a Aries Leo or Sagittarius this is going to be a wonderful experience there is going to be bringing balancing in your life um, um, a, a whole lot of achievement is going to happen in the last week of September whatever it is an organization is going to find you and it's going to take you and it's going to move you it's going to help you an organization is looking at you the energy vibration of the Prince of Cups could be the energy vibration that you yourself are carrying or it could be playing out that someone else who is a prince of cups is from out of organization is looking at what you're doing and is very appreciated and there is going to be a synchronistic event that the universe is going to place you two together and he's going to use you and show you how you can make money in your life a lot of wonderful synchronistic event is going to happen between you and this person okay this is positive this is extremely positive you're going to be working it's as if at the end of the day wh whoever you connect with in this organization it's going to be a victorious situation over the Queen of Cups whatever is happening this energy is came out there is just always strange things happening you're going to be victorious over the Queen of Cups so whoever have a situation a discomponement with the energy vibration of the Queen of Cups you're going to be victorious over this Queen of Cups whatever whoever this person is you're going to be victorious over this energy another situation that is happening at the end of September I am seeing here whoever this organization um, if you have been training or whatever in an organization looking for work or whatever it the situation is because I see in the beginning of the month that there was conflicts with other people and the energy vibration of the Knight of Pentacles whatever the situation is there is organization that is going to people who are connecting with organization whether you have a business whether you're working in an organization it's going to be very positive you're going to meet the energy vibration of the princess the prince of cups in an organization he he has been looking at you for a very long time and really seen your potential and with this he's going to work with you he's going to set up um, and, and working with you he's going to work with you and you are going to make a lot of money whoever you are out there whatever it is if you're working in that organization or you're about to begin it in a new organization in the month of September it's going to at the end of September you're going to make money um, because this organization is going to take you they see your potential and they're going to take you and work with you and at the end of the day money you won't have any problems with money it's as if you know you begin in an organization and someone see you and realize that you have um, full potential and they're going to take you on and train you and help you to move to a level um, let's see what we're having um, what are we having in the love field for the Capricorns in the month of September what we're having in the love field in the month of September we have um, in the month of September we are having situations that are happening for us in the month of September and we have the energy vibration of people um, whatever it is uh, in the month of September your love life in the first week you're going to realize that people are pretending um, to having this you know you're going to get a message about a job and about you being a new employee 
in the, the first week but this job is as if somebody likes you and wants to invite you to come and work with them but the message about this job is actually the person really likes you and the person wants you to come and work in that organization so for people who are looking for a new job and that sort of a thing because there's going to be a conflict there's going to be people speaking about you so it's as if this person invites you to come and work in their company or in their organization or with them and people are talking about you you know people are like speaking about you and you know it but it, it's cunning the way they do it because they really like you and they really want to connect with you but the way they did it is very cunning so be aware of this that whoever asks you to come and work with them or be partner with them there is more to this situation than what you're seeing happening right at this moment okay be aware okay sometimes people want to connect with you and they don't know how to do it and they do it in um, sneaky ways and you're thinking why didn't you just tell me that you know you like me and it's not really that you want uh, that is more it's not work but it's that you want to connect with me uh, sometimes it's better that people tell you the truth because you Capricorn do not like when people lie to you the second week the second week is going to be wonderful whatever the situation is in the second week there is going to be um, um, problems in your relationship in the second week some people are going to have problems in your relationship whether in your marriage or whether in your uh, relationship whether you're having a relationship and there is going to come a distance between you and your friends so whatever is happening in the third week there is going to be problem in your relationship and a distance between you and your friends for some people for other people there is going to be you visiting friends or or some friends coming over to visit you a travel companionship uh, maybe you are going on a vacation and you ask someone if you will they would could join you or or maybe someone invites you out to, to go on a cruise or um, you know uh, um, uh, with a cruise or a plane or with a, a car uh, you know they invite you out to to be on the strip with them so it could be someone who really likes you and want to connect with you and it could be the same for you so in the th in the third week there's going to be different scenarios that explain out in your love relationship okay so as we the second week I mean in the third week as we look at whatever is happening um, the energy in the third week is going to be such a positive positive energy because what is happening here is that uh, great news is going to come in about a relationship whatever the situation is uh, good news is going to be coming out about a relationship good news um, successful news the encounter of positive energy and good news good wonderful news is going to come out to you whatever the situation is there is going to be positive message coming out to, to you people are letting you know how they feel about you people are exchanging their feelings for you and letting you know how they really feel about you which is a very good as we look at the last week with the love uh, situation we are having the energy vibration of uh, a confusing message from someone who you have been seen like people who have been seeing someone and then you haven't heard from them a while and then all of a sudden you you got a message as if yeah I've been trying to call you and uh, it can happen it can happen so this message is confusing let me see is it a true what was the confusion was it the truth that was been told yeah there can be <clears throat> confusing message but it's the truth that has been told whatever the situation is if the person said yeah I have been trying to connect with you sometimes or telephone and the last time because we're in merger uh, mercury retrograde um, information do not come out as uh, um, as you know clearly as how it should be because we're in the metro braid and 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 this can ha this can happen so whatever you know if you are seeing someone you have been seeing the person and all of a sudden you have heard nothing and uh, you know you, you you're receiving 
a confusing messages sometimes you're in relationship you're seeing period and you really don't know where you are with this relationship because people are not being honest how they feel about the relationship so for um, the fourth week a lot of people will be having um, con confusing messages coming to them with their love life but in their work life it's going to be positive let's see how we're ending this uh, month's reading for you guys and you have the energy here for you guys as um, I can replace false premonitions with uh, I can replace false premonition with law base uh, premonition okay so you can replace false premonition so if you always have been saying how ugly I am or fat I am or, or you know this sort of a thing you can replace it with I am perfectly fine the way I am <laughs> Okay, there has been a team unfolding air of replacing false premonition with the law based premonition, and we would like to leave you with a final one. We all make too much of all of this, it is simply that we all make it out to be. Be easy about this be kind to yourself do things that feel fun look for things that bring you relief and just easily move into that place your vortex where all things that you want have already been lined up for you okay so this is good this is wonderful you Capricorns out there congratulations okay let's see what the ascendance masters have for you guys what does the ascendance masters what ascendance masters is going to work with the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising for this you have the ascendance masters retreat okay so you Capricorns you have the ascendance masters retreat the great masses of the the heart have had incarnated master master their life lessons and the ascendants they are disciplined but compassionate for they understand the challenges of being in a physical body and don't I know it oh god people I don't know if you feel like I feel it but being in a physical body is not one of the easiest things okay this is an invitation to visit in your sleep and meditation those ascendance masters from whom you wish to learn in their retreat in the inner planes they um, teach their skills and knowledge to students you can absorb this at an erratic level and start to bring the wisdom into your life if you feel a resonation a, a, a resonance with particular ascendance ma as you resonate with particularly ascendance masters ask them to guide you I walk with the ascendance masters 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 so for you Capricorns it is the gift to connect at nights or in meditation to work with the ascendance master in whatever way you would like to okay so this is a very positive this is very good so ladies and gentlemen um, boys and girl let's look at what is going on here and as we look at the energy vibration let's see what is here for the Sun moon horizon sign planet of Jupiter that's good and for the moon sign we have Saturnus okay so you Capricorns who was born in the night there is going to be a huge change coming in your life and the Capricorns are coming up Capricorns and Virgo for the Sun people and we have the cancer and Leo for the moon people so okay let's look at what is going to be happening for the Sun people we have the energy vibration of the energy vibration of Jupiter so for the Sun people for the people who were born in the day we have Jupiter the planet of Jupiter for you guys and the planet of Jupiter is bringing more Capricorn people and Virgo people to help you out so this is going to be wonderful so the planet of Jupiter is going to bring Capricorn and Virgo people to bring um, um, 
um, magic in your life is going to bring you a lot of luck so you're going to connect with other Capricorn people and Virgo people and this is going to bring you a positive and a lot of luck in your life so this is going to be very positive for you Sun sign because whenever your same uh, um, zodiac star people are coming in to help you and your sister zodiac star of the Virgos this is going to be positive and they are bringing you a lot of luck with the Sun people so this is going to be wonderful as we look at the moon people which is going to go in another um, direction for the moon people we have the energy vibration of the Saturnus Saturnus so for you moon people whatever the situation is your life is going to be turning upside down you have the energy vibration of the Kansas and the Leos to deal with so some people are going to have aggression from the cancers and the Leo some people are going to have to work with the cancers and the Leo's with whatever situation in your um, your whole entire beam you know whatever is happening is that the cancers and the Leo's are going to have a focus on who you are and a connection on who you are so be aware but whatever the situation is you're going to be victorious uh, over the situation whatever is happening you're going to be extremely extremely victorious over whatever situation that is happening and whoever this person is uh, this uh, um, person who is a Libran of a, a, a you know it's it's going to be happening it's going to be good you're going to victorious over this person so ladies and gentlemen please listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign and general reading and I want to say thank you for being here namaste until next week next month